What's going on Team Review Zone? So I told you it was coming and here it is, the Dremel Velocity 7.0 amp and nine times faster speed of cut. Today we're gonna cut through screws, we're cutting through wood, we're gonna cut through metal pipe and then a door. This thing has professional written all over it. Let's get the review started. Now this velocity is made for professional use. If you're a plumber, a contractor, a woodworker, wait until you see what this thing can actually do. Now if eight settings weren't enough, they actually put a hyper speed on this thing. I will let you hear it, I will let you see it. It is unbelievable how much faster you can cut with the hyper speed mode on. Now this does come with a bunch of sanding pads and different blades for wood and metal. But in case you're wondering, yes, it does accept any Dremel blade you have already. Now anybody that's ever held a Dremel tool knows how well they are built. This is no different. It has the exact same build, just on a larger scale. Even though this may be bigger than what you're used to with Dremel, it feels very comfortable in the hands. You get a very nice grip to it. The on and off button also very easy to use. The hyper speed, very cool, very easy to dial in. You can go very low to very high speeds. You can go anywhere from 10,000 up to 16,000 oscillations per minute with this thing. Now I'm gonna show you this little shoe here in a bit. This thing is so cool and it really helps while you're cutting paneling or any other type of flat surface. Very simple to use. All you have to do to close it is push the blue button and fold it in. This really allows you to just glide across the material that you're cutting and it also helps you keep a straighter line. Now another huge upgrade that they made to the Velocity is that it is a keyless blade change. All you have to do is pull that lever and you can see it release right here. Those blades go right down underneath and it tightens itself. You no longer need a wrench to loosen any bolts or nuts on this tool. All you have to do is pull that lever, your blade goes right on. You may want to turn down your volume a little bit because I'm going to let you hear what this sounds like at 10,000 OPM all the way up to 16,000. All right, let's make some cuts. We got a couple screws set up. We're gonna use our metal blade. We're gonna see how well these things go through. Well, FYI, we're only at 10,000 RPM. We're on the lowest speed. Let's turn it up to 16,000 RPM, hyper speed. That was very, very impressive. Now let's change out the blade. I'll show you how easy that is. Now we have another metal cutting blade on here. Let's check this out. All right, so now we're gonna cut some wood here. It goes extremely quick through wood, just very fast. On the next clip, I will let you listen to it and actually hear what it sounds like going through wood.
All right, turn down your volume. FYI, this dowel is 5 eighths of an inch round. Okay, so now what I want to do is actually cut down through this door. It is a hollow door, but I want to show you this shoe, this guide, if you will. It's really cool and it actually makes cutting a lot easier. Watch how easy this actually goes through. Like butter. Now I'm going to show you a close up here in the next clip. Now that plate just makes it so much easier to cut through that really adds a lot of control. It just goes through that wood like, like nothing, like nothing at all. So how cool is that? That hyper speed really just adds so much to this. Now, if you're asking yourself if this can sand as well, yes, it can. It comes with an attachment and it does it very, very well. Check this out. Right now, we're at 10,000 OPM. We're gonna bump it up to 16,000. This thing is insane. It takes that paint off so easily. It's just so smooth. All right, guys, so I know I'm going a little overboard with this, but I wanted to put this thing to the test. I will tell you I'm not playing this whole clip. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. It did take me around three minutes to cut through this steel pipe. Now, as you're watching in amazement, this does plug into 120 volts, 10,000 to 16,000 OPM. You get a seven foot cord on this thing, very beastly. And again, 10,000 to 16,000 OPM. There you go, guys. It might not be the prettiest, but it did it. I really wanted to put this thing to the test and man, did it exceed my expectations. Uh, I had already told you that this was built for the professional. Is this a little bit much for a DIYer? Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you, it probably is. Go with something a little bit smaller unless you really want the big gun. But this thing is just awesome. I love the, the toolless disc change on this thing. It just makes it so much easier. The comfortable grip, you know, the, the shoe that just helps you glide. Everything about this is just really, really nice. And it's built just as well as any other Dremel that you will find. All of the Dremel bits are interchangeable. I'm giving it a five star all the way. Wait until you guys actually get this in your hands. You're going to be blown away. So here's the deal. If you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe. Check us out at www.tourreviewzone.com. We're going to be back with more videos soon.